Kia ora guys, what's going on and welcome back to my channel. So, I cannot remember the last day that I had a full day off work over the summer. So, I work shift work, so sometimes I'll have a morning shift, sometimes an afternoon, sometimes both. I cannot remember the last day I had a full day off and today is the day. So, we're making the most of it and we're heading to Invercargill. Which, if you live in New Zealand, you'll know is actually not that exciting. But, nonetheless, we're going there. They have a Kmart. We don't have a Kmart in Dunedin anymore, so you best bet that we're going there. And yeah, I thought I'd bring you guys along. I'm about to head to the gym, and then we're going to head straight off from there and go to Invercargill. So yeah, I thought I'd bring you along, make a little bit of a vlog out of it. So yeah, if you do like this video, or you like my other videos, make sure you give this one a big thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, and let's get on with the vlog. <laughs> Alrighty, so first things up, Jim, come with me to my cupboard. Hopefully you'll be able to see it. The light's, the light's not great over this side of the room, but come to my cupboard. Oh. Alright, this is what we want to see. Yeah, supplements. Alright, want this one. And... Yeah, that's right. Alright, so I'm being a little bit cheeky this morning. I'm heading to the gym. A little bit earlier than it opens, perks of working there. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go. The gym will normally open at 9 on a Saturday, which is unfortunate because we wanted to leave at 10.30. So I know that one of my workmates will be getting there at quarter to 9, and so will I. So that I can get in there, um, do my hip thrusts, and do my other workouts so that I can have a shower before I go. Anyway, I just popped that into my shaker if it wants to focus. There we go. Micronized creatine. That's the one. And then to that, I'm adding. Why is it being done with the focusing today? Anyway, I'm gonna add one and a half scoops of oxyshirin. There we go. So that is that one there. I'm just waiting on my new pre workout to turn up. So I'm just waiting for that. Hopefully, it'll turn up soon because. I'm getting a bit impatient. I've seen everybody else drinking it and trying it out, and I really want to try it too. In terms, it's to do with EHP Labs. Yes. Anyway, so I'm going to shake this up, drink it, probably on the way to the gym, and well, I might as well tell you what I'm doing now. I'm not going to film at the gym because Saturday mornings are just they're just too busy, too busy, and I like to respect other people's privacy when it comes to working out. So, I'm gonna go in there. I'm gonna do a little bit of glitch activation now while I drink this, walk to the gym, nice speed walk to warm up those legs, um, and then when I get there I'm going to go do hip thrusts, probably not too heavy, I think I'm going to go for reps rather than weight, but I'm still going to go around like 60, 70, and then after that I'm going to do a little quick circuit of about, I think it was six exercises, so I'm going to do step ups onto the box but with a heavy bar on my back, so I'm going to do one leg for each set of time, and then I'm going to do box jumps with the bar, like sitting down onto the box, oh, box squat jump, sorry, so sitting down onto the box and then jump squatting up holding that bar. And I'm going to do some glute bridges but with my feet raised either onto the box or onto the wall, lifting those glutes up using the band. And then I'm going to do Bulgarian split spots because we're going to get the gains in those glutes and uh, yeah, I'll use a kettlebell, maybe a bar. I don't know, I'm pretty weak when it comes to that, so I'll do those each leg. The plan is 30 seconds on, 10 seconds off for all of the exercises, um, and then a minute break once you're done, and then repeat that four or five times. It depends on how sore my legs are by then. So yeah, that'll be my quick workout. So, yeah, that's it. All right, well, I will see you guys after I have been to the gym, after I've had a shower, and the next time you see me, we'll probably be, be in the car before we head off. Yeah, well. Hello. <laughs> Alrighty, so we made it to Invercargill. As you would have seen, Jerry filmed. I was driving, so I didn't really film much, but Jerry filmed some of the stuff on the way. And we're now at the most important part of the entire trip. 
where it came up. So I'm not gonna bring my camera inside because I will get in trouble, but hopefully I will film a little bit. Show you what I get when I come out because they better have the stuff that I want, otherwise this trip was relatively pointless. All right, let's go inside. <laughs> Burger, burger, meat on chips. Hi you. Hi you. What are we doing, Georgia? We're going to Bluff, Aiden. Oh. <laughs> oh. Um, no, we just had lunch as you would have seen. Got some boo fuel, got some meat on chips for Aiden. Now we're going to Bluff to go to the bottom of the South Island. There's like a signpost there. It's the same as up the very top, up the top of the North Island, but yeah, so we're gonna go down to the bottom. It's about half an hour drive, so yeah. Let's go. 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 When I'm up through the night I can't turn down the noise Say all the words out of my mind About who I'm supposed to be I start to believe I can't get it right Remember the days I let slip away They were simple at times Mama told me before you leave If there's only one thing you remember from me Child, when you're out on your own A million miles from home Feeling the way I'm walking too, guys! <laughs> Child, don't forget who you are Don't lose your head or your heart I'll bet my life on your stars You'll be dancing Dancing on the moon I'll bet my life You'll be dancing on the moon Can I get a hoya? Hoya! 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 Alright, done a bluff. Done it, bluff. You would have seen all the little footage that Aiden you're popped bluffing. his head. No, oh, you're bluffing. You're bluffing, you're mate. Bluffing, right? Heading back to Invercargill now and then deciding what to do before we head on back home. Probably via the scenic route. Maybe my compass was wrong. And I'm still on my way. Floss and stick to where I belong. To roll in the dance, praying sometimes Don't last it long I'm losing my faith I'm walking away from what you knew all along Mama told me before you leave If there's only one thing you remember from me Child, when you're out on your own A million miles
walking the scenic round. I'm just getting back into the car. We stopped at Nugget Point, which is really cool. It was a little bit longer of a drive, but totally worth it. So now we're just heading back to Dunedin to go home, which is another like hour and a half away. But you know what? Also, two seconds. Let's have a look at this. Hello. <laughs> Look at the sun and the, the sky right now, all right? Hold on, let me get it to focus. So, blue sky, absolutely beautiful sun up in the sky. It is eight o'clock at night. Eight o'clock at night, let me just show you that one there. Eight o'clock, and it's beautiful outside. Anyway, we're off now. Say so goodbye. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Where I belong. To roll in the dust, praying sometimes. Don't let's get low. I'm losing my faith. I'm walking away from what you knew all along. Mama told me before you leave. Alrighty, so we are now home. It has been such a long day, but it's about almost 20 to 10 at night. And I'm hungry, so food's in the oven. But I thought I'd just show you what I got from Kmart since why not? Gotta love good Kmart haul. We'll I'll start off with this big bag of um, lollies, which is not mine. This is Jerry's. Um, he was wanting to come away with something from Kmart, and so he came away with a 48 piece pack of gummy lollies. So that's that. Um, also got a, is it six piece, five piece. Utensils for the kitchen Random, but like we needed them so awesome. Then I also got some more coat hangers So I don't know if I've shown you guys My gym shark that I've hung up. Maybe I'll do a quick show of this before I end the video But yeah, so I got some more wooden coat hangers. I got three packets of six coat hangers, so a decent amount of coat hangers um, and then I also got some of the wooden Oh no, they're all stuck together. The wooden kind of what are they like pants hangers so I can hang up my shorts uh, for my gym shark again priorities um, and then finally two more things I got this life planner so I actually just got accepted for my masters which means I will be starting in about just over a month and so I got this one because I will show you what it looks like on the inside this is a really oh so both sides. Anyway, the first side looks like this. So here's the to-do list. You tick the day, you can put the date, um, your top three priorities for the day, and then you can list all the things that you need to do. And I love the tick boxes because I love ticking things off. And then on the other side, there's like a little note section for discussion, um, any notes that you need to write during the day. So got this one because it means that I can not only track everything the way I like to during the day without having to write it up myself, but it also means that, you know, it's all there. It's super easy and I can just write whatever days it is and I don't have to like, if I miss days, if I say start on the second and then I miss a couple of days and I start again on the sixth, I can just easily write that in rather than missing whole blank pages. It just doesn't waste as much space. It's also a little pocket at the back. I don't even realise that, but does it open? Yeah. I'll stick a little things in the pocket. Anyway, so that was that and finally I got this calendar. It's a family size calendar. I'm gonna put it up in the kitchen, just over there. And let's see if I can open it up. I don't know if you guys have seen a family size calendar before. A family calendar, it's one of those ones that has, obviously one page is a month, and it has all of the days written out, and then at the top it has little sections for names, or things that need to be done, family members, whatnot. Normally, I remember my mum used to use them for like each person in the family and what they had on that day. So for example, I'm bringing it up nice and close, hopefully you can see. Oh, there's lots of stuff in the way. Anyway, at the top here, it has name. So you put the person's name or the thing that needs to be done at the top. And then it's got all of the days of the week. So it's got, for example, this is June, first is a Tuesday. And so what my plan for this is, is to write things that me and Jerry both need to do. So for example, one of them is gonna be creatine to make sure I take creatine every day since that is my goal. What well, has been for Gymshark 66 and I'm going to keep it going afterwards. So creatines I can either highlight or tick off that I've done it that day and keep a track of it that way. I think for Jerry and me we're both just going to put stretching on there as well so that we can stretch every day and just track how often we're stretching and looking after our bodies in that way. So that's going to be cute and go up on the wall. Also I forgot one last thing that I got from Kmart. This 
bad boy. So it is a ring light with a, like a Bluetooth button thingy my book. So super bright 10 inch LED light ring with 120 LEDs and three light modes. So yeah, I got that so that my photos that I take for Instagram and for potential TikToks, if I get into that, we'll see how it goes. So that it's a little bit, oh wow, this is really not a good angle. So that is a little bit better, a little bit cleaner and it's a little bit more well lit. Also, I really like the idea of having the Bluetooth button thing. Because at the moment, what I do to take photos is I put it up and I do the whole, I don't know if you guys know the hand trick. We stand back from the camera and you like put your hand forward and it kind of uses your hand as a reference to take the photo. It's like a go take the photo. And so I'll like stand back, get ready for my pose, take the hand up, and it'll see my hand and it'll start the timer, the countdown, like really quickly. And I'll be like, oh. So hopefully this time now with the Bluetooth button-y thing, I will be able to take photos a lot easier and get in better positions than what I could do just using the hand method. So yeah, that is now everything that I got from Kmart. <laughs> so first, before I finish this, I'll show you my Gymshark. Come on, come, come, come with me, come. All right, so. Coming here, so hello Jerry. So let's move that one out of the way. This is my pride and joy. This is my gym shark. So as you can see, I've got them all hung up on coat hangers. But then, oh, there's nothing on those. Oh, that's a good example. Shorts. They're on metal ones at the moment. It's not really the vibe I'm going for. So now I've got the the wooden ones, and they're all going to look perfect together. So I'll do a full update, I think, soon of all of the gym shark that I have. I may or may not be waiting on a couple more pieces. Or we'll pretend that Jerry didn't hear that one. Hmm. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'm waiting on a couple more things to come. And you know, there's going to be another release soon. So I got extra coat hangers just in case. I'll stand you up. Beautiful. Hello. All right, so that is the video team. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed traveling around the South Island with us. It was very cool. Um, when I told people at work that I was going to Invercargill, they were like, really? Invercargill of all places? Not gonna lie, it was actually a really good time. My heart is very full. My stomach may be empty right now, but my heart is full from that trip. Nugget Point was definitely one of my favorite parts. So that was probably the last part that you guys saw where we went and there was a lighthouse and then there was those rocks that looked like nuggets. And so hence Nugget Point. Um, but yeah, if you guys like the video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you guys subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Bye.